Good morning everyone, uh, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi, coming to you guys from Phuket, from our house over there. Uh, Bitcoin still moving crazy as fuck. So we are going to zoom into the charts, zoom out into the charts, but showing you, um, are we going to see this retrace from 21k to 12k? Are we going to continue from 21k to 25k? Uh, let's quickly jump into charts to show what is happening, bam, over here. This is the first one. Always remember if you trade, bam, trade on by bit. You can claim up to 30,000 US dollar bonus. You get $30 for just joining Bybit by using our link down below this video. And if you deposit some Bitcoins, you can claim up to 30,000 US dollar, guys. Really cool over there. Now, I'm starting today uh, on the day chart. Why on the day chart? Because I'm not going to stress out on this uh, lower time frames. Uh, you've seen the Bam Bam indicator performing very well on those lower time frames. But let's look at the bigger time frames. This is the day chart. As you all know, we broke that red line it's a 200 day moving average i showed you in the video two days ago there's a very important line because every time when we break that we get bullish that was a 3k to 14k run back to 3k and then again the huge bull run just because we broke that line on the daily time frame we are breaking that something else that i'm seeing on the chart now on the daily is this green line here down there you can see this is the 50 um, daily moving average so the 50 is going to point upwards 200 200 and every time when that green line i'm going to zoom out a little bit for you guys and um, so you can see crosses that red line that was not a bad situation for bitcoin so the first time for example over here that was the start of that huge bull run over there that was that 3 to 30k uh, uh, to 14k pump and back again so that's why i'm saying this is maybe not completely the start this was this COVID crash you know but every time when we see that we can see pumps small pump huge pump and we can go back further and further and further but every time when that green line crosses that beautiful red line uh, that is the moment over there bam that that bull run started and that is not happening at the moment but it's very positive to now see um that beautiful green line pointing upwards towards that red line that is because these candles are closing above that red line at the moment uh, can we see something anything else on a daily yeah on a daily we can see the macd turning positive positive. Um, the thing that worries me on the daily to be very honest is this one over here this is the bam bam indicator but that blue line that is like the rsi and um, the last time it was this high as 92 that's a very long time ago and every time when we get that high with the rsi we will see a correction so for me that is like a warning this rsi is really high a correction could um, appear now in the next couple of days but let's see uh, uh, what the other charts are telling us now we have the weekly of course this is the weekly now this weekly um i've been i think talk about now like for Two, three months when i told you okay this uh, when we were rejected we will go down but there will be a moment we get a new lower high and i drew that line already like a few weeks away go on the on the uh, on the charts like you know just check all the videos i'm not lying and that dotted line we are breaking that now and then i told you if we break that dotted line we could go hunt for that downward white dotted trend line and that is what exactly what we are doing we are hunting that line does it mean that we are in a bull market no it means that we want to break that dotted line and if we break that dotted line yes then it becomes very exciting yes then we can start talking and dreaming about a bull market but if we find resistance at this line we could fall down again so very important to understand it's a beautiful pump in bitcoin it's not fully bull run as yet because um, the rsi is really high a correction is due in my opinion but let's see you never know in bitcoin let's zoom out a little bit more here to the monthly on the monthly we have the bam bam indicator um doing really cool giving along that was a shitload of profit just to uh, show you from that long uh, to the kiwi to profit was 127 percent okay uh, at that moment it gave a short was a good short then again along that was the start of the huge bull run that was a profit of let's say we take a low late over there to the short over there 400 percent so on the monthly chart the bam bam indicator has been performing pretty well it also gave the short over there already for um the, the bull market we were in 
and at the moment it is flashing long to be very honest this lawn will only stay there if in 15 days and 18 hours this candle closes like this. If this candle will crash in all the way down below the purple line, for example, then that lawn will um, disappear because it closes the moment the candle is closing uh, completely. And this is a monthly chart, so it will take another 15 days for this candle to close. But at least that's the first time again we saw this long flashing, which is a very uh, bullish signal on the BAM BAM indicator. If you want to have access to the BAM BAM indicator, you go to the bitcoinfamily.com products and you will find all the indicator packages, also the family spotbot and you find also the GT guard, which is a free indicator. Now I'm going to take you into three more very interesting charts over them here. This is the first one, uh, very important because at the moment uh, the fear and greed index is at 45. This is like the neutral zone the yellowish between red and greenish neutral so um, it's still fearish but people are turning neutral for the first time since a very long time um, is this good ah, yes that is probably the reason why people start to buy bitcoin again but if we look at this chart guys uh, then we need to be aware that for example also this chart you can also see that the rsi is really high like yes every time when the rsi came that high like this area we had that huge bull run this area we had that huge bull run and look how high the rsi is at the moment it's like very high so it's bull run high but always remember um, there's always corrections in these bull runs so every time when we top that high we can see the rsi coming down mostly we see a small correction maybe we pump 18 percent and we dump 20 percent whatever it's all possible but the rsi is high it's an indication of being very bullish at the moment we can i can't make anything else of it but here on this chart you will see for example um, why it's very important that we also must see that when the rsi is that high uh, that we uh, are mostly seeing a pullback because look for example over here we touched it we had a pump but we had a pullback i think it's a 20 percent pullback it doesn't show like that because it's a, um, a small area of the chart now but for example here it shows better rsi touched that line that like 90 line and after that so we had a pump after that we had this huge crash i think it's a 20 20 percent crash about 20 percent so that's for 40k till almost 28k so when the rsi goes that high when the rsi goes that high we can expect a small correction so let's see how bitcoin is holding maybe all the bullish news is pumping bitcoin even higher let's see where it goes but it's very cool to see how this market plays out now um, another beautiful chart is this one um, this one is from crypto quant um, and it's show, showing us the funding rates and on the funding rates we can also see every time when these funding rates are this high the green bars on the bottom uh, we see a correction in the bitcoin price funding rates high correction in the bitcoin price funding rates high correction in the bitcoin price funding rates are high so also there is shouting correction in the bitcoin price but we never know that is the cool thing of bitcoin you never know next chart over here um, we have this one yes it makes me laugh because i've been in this situation now since 2013 and i had the 2014 crash i had the 2019 crash i had the 2021 crash and it's always happy to see that we are still a little bit crashy but also getting bullish again you know you, people become um, interactive with the market again very cool now on this chart you can see uh, something very cool there's a weekly chart um this is uh, the weekly chart of the US dollar, like you can see here on the top, there, there, there. You can see the weekly US dollar currency index. Every time when the dollar crashes, like down below that bluish line, we see a bull run in the Bitcoin price. When the dollar crashed, we saw the 2020 bull run. This is when the 2017 bull run was. Every time when that dollar crashes, you see? So the bars are the dollar, crashes down below the blue line, we have the Bitcoin bull line. Below, below the blue line, we have a Bitcoin bull run. This is very special what is happening over here because it's not the right timing yet but the dollar is crashing down below the blue line that could mean another short-term bitcoin bull run this is very interesting to see in my opinion completely different than history but it could be an unexpected bull run in 2023-24 we don't know but the charts are telling us exactly that what we can only read of the charts they are not like lying to us 
okay now uh, the last thing that i want to talk to you about is this one also very interesting why is this one very interesting because this one shows you um, that of all the assets that there are um bitcoin has still the best return of investment so if you look at the um, cumulative return of investment over here in bitcoin um look it's it's huge it's huge and even if you take it annualized it's 148 percent a year over the last like 10 years 11 years so if you compare it to all the other ones bitcoin is way by far by far the best asset that you can be in by far the best asset bitcoin by the way is here on the bottom as you can see and uh, 2022 was a bearish year 18 was a bearish year and 14 was a bearish year four years later 2014 four years later 2018 four years later 2022 2023 will be green again in my opinion but even if you zoom out longer zoom out 10 years bitcoin is the best asset you can be in that is why bam we as the bitcoin family live the bitcoin standard which means bitcoin is our main currency everything we own is in bitcoin and sometimes we will use thai baht or mexican pesos or the euro if we're in europe but we always go back to our standard currency and that is bitcoin because it's deflationary and it's increasing in value all the time so yes sometimes we spend a little bit bitcoin more expensive sometimes a little bit more cheap but on average we are spending less bitcoins every year on everything that we do in our life so that's why we call it living the bitcoin standard now if you have any more questions about that look at all the other thousand videos that we already are making for the last years and um, i'm very happy that you're still watching all these videos if you did like this video again give it a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification and leave a comment what do you think about these charts uh, the facts do you expect a pullback or do you think bitcoin will bam on to 25k or something like that thanks for watching see you tomorrow again bam